Hello and welcome to my stream. My screen name is Ombreon, and I am both a StarCraft 2 and League of Legends player. Uh, I'm working my way up the rank settings. I'm currently Silver 2, and these guys, this team right here, is going to help me get a little bit farther. These are some good players. Uh, we have a Zed. Uh, his name is Dummy286, I believe. 287. Or 387. Uh, we have Cassidin. Uh, let's follow him around for a second. Black Flash Man, and uh, we have um, Inks Inspiration as Ezreal, and Pyronax as Thresh. And I'm Ombreom, your host, playing as Amumu. We have a pretty stacked team, actually. Most of these players are, are banned, and uh, I'm surprised that uh, they did not ban them in this fight. But of course, uh, the banning the banning changes over, uh, over the over time. Like you, you don't have the same three champions always banned because people find new champions to hate and new champions that they think are OP. Uh, that was a nice forward ward to see this, this uh, that, that Thresh was sitting there, but instead of going in on him and stunning him and actually taking him out, they, they just poke him and let him know that, that, that they're there, so they kind of give away that little advantage. Um, not much is going to happen, we're all just wandering around. Let me introduce the top top team, because I, I haven't done so yet. Uh, we have Taco Flock of Flame as Jinx, we have the Untold Warrior as Vi, we have Livid Mad as Leona, and in the middle we have My Pleasure as Fizz, who's taking a nap. Um, and then up here on top we're going to have Rengar as uh, Saint Swift. So, they have a good team too. Uh, honestly, uh, they make a really good decision here. They, they move in to, uh, to steal my red, and because there's no ward here, uh, my team is none the wiser. So this is a good start for them, giving them a little bit of a lead as far as buffs go. And uh, they do ward their own red, uh, fortunately, so that I can't actually steal it. I don't know that this is happening, so I am totally oblivious and completely happy with my situation. So I'm just, uh, well, happy is, a <laughs> happy is an interesting choice of words, because Amumu is, the, after all, the sad mummy. So, uh, let's see. Uh, okay, here, here's the fight up top. We have uh, Dummy387 facing off with Saint Swift. Um, both both laying down some some early game pressure, and I would think that Zed would win early game because he'd be able to poke a little bit more and then uh, and not take quite so much damage. But he does get really close into Rengar, and Rengar gets off a couple nice uh, nice attacks here. I'm surprised Rengar doesn't use the bushes as much, um, but he is just confident in his health. This part uh, was wow. I, I'm really surprised Zed actually went back in there. Uh, he could have gotten away, but um, he. To, to, to be fair, he did almost get Rengar. Just a little bit more damage down, and he would have would have finished Rengar off. So, um, well, good try by him. Well played. And uh, we're going to see an early... I'm I am currently at level 2, and because they stole my red, I'm going to be at level 2 for a while. It's, it's kind of unfortunate. Uh, so I'm not really going to be able to do a lot. Uh, wow. Uh, Inspiration and Pyrenax are uh, putting down some pain on Livin' Mad and Taco Flock of Flame. Wow, these names are awesome. <laughs> what a great set of names in, all in one game. So, I'm just going to take this, this moment to let you guys know that this video will be on YouTube and on Twitch. Um, it's going to have to be in two parts because they only let me upload 15 minute videos at the, at the moment. Uh, so, just look for the, the date uh, and then I'll just have part one and part two in, in the name of the title. But if you really want to find all my videos, they're all on channel Ombreon. Uh, on, on Twitch, spelled O-M-B-U-R-I-O-M. -O okay, so we haven't had another death yet, and uh, the, the opponent opposing team is a little bit ahead in gold, but but not too much. I'm going to come around and try to, to take out Fizz here, because I do have my level 3 stun now. But uh, he's going to... Let's see, let's see what happens. Okay, he's... He managed to flash and then uh, do his little pole vaulting technique. That was that was well played. Um, I do forget the name of that skill. I am not completely familiar with Fizz. Ooh, now this was bad of me. I kind of face checked into this part of the map. I had no vision, and uh, early game Vi can certainly take me out. Um, so I'm in, I'm really bad shape. But Cassian comes in to save me. He does a ton of damage, and my stun locks Vi down, so she can't vault block, vault, vault block. I can't even say it. She can't get away. And Cassidy picks up the double kill. That was a really nice play by Black Flash Man. His Cassidy is is uh, off to a really good start in this game. Um, he he played that very well, and he uh, he survived it. He's farming better, and uh, 
Now, uh, well, we have an interesting play coming up. Leona is at almost full health, but she's only at level 3, and Cassidin has made it to level 6, because thanks to that double kill. So Leona's going to try to come in and, and cut him off and take him out, but he's also got the red buffs, so, which she did not, I don't think she planned on. If she'd had her double stun on him and, and her W, that might have actually killed him. Um, but uh, it was a good try, uh, but Cassidin was too much, and now he's, now he's got uh, three kills. So we have a... Th uh, oh, no. Okay, one, two kills and one assist. So I must have picked up one of those kills, which is nice, uh, nice for me. Um, so, so, but we still have a 2-0 Cassidin with one assist, and uh, that's just a really good start for our team. Um, so we're, we're in a good position. 4-2, uh, to two, we have a little bit more gold, but uh, this game is far from over. Uh, we've still got quite a bit of time left, and uh, we're going see, to see just what happens, just, just how these how this thing shakes out. Okay, we have a fight going on up top, uh, uh, Sw Swift versus Dummy, but uh, Dummy, let's see, Dummy, he's going to be able to escape uh, in these fights almost every single time, but he's taking a lot more damage than, uh, than I think he wants to, and uh, Swift is doing a good job of, of staying in the lane and, and farming better, actually, significantly better. I'm going to I'm gonna wander up here and uh, try to help out a little bit, because I thought Zed was going to go in on Rengar, but it didn't actually happen. Um, let's see, let's see what happens here. Okay, no, situation diffused, not much, not much going on. Um, I'm going to try to catch all the fights, there's, you know, there's a big board, guys, I'm going to try to catch all your highlights, all your, all your impressive moments, but, uh, I, you know, I'm going to miss something somewhere, so if you want me to, uh, recast the video so that you can see everything, I'll do my best, you know, I'll, I'll provide whatever content you want, please feel free to, to put comments into my, uh, YouTube window, uh, my, you know, un under the video, and I'll, I'll do the best that I can, um, so we, we uh, we're reaching the um, the end of the laning phase pretty soon. Uh, maybe in another five, three or four or five minutes. Uh, yep. Okay. Well, yeah, we have some roaming going on. Cassin's coming down. This, you know, I I wanted him to take the blue, but you know, to his to his credit, he decided just to go ahead for the kill, and and he's gonna get it. I mean, there's nothing gonna stop him there. That was well played. He almost got the double actually. Uh, if he had saved that that area of effect attack, I think he would have gotten the double. But it doesn't matter. <laughs> They're going to get it anyway. This team is, is really good. Uh, Zed went back, uh, so I'm going to gonna hold top for him for, for a minute and uh, takes, take a little more damage than I should. Uh, but I do uh, do keep Rengar from pushing this lane at all. Uh, Fizz is trying to sneak around back and take out Ezreal, but I think this is an ill-fated attack because he's, he's quite surrounded at this point, and uh, he's going to take too long, and, and Vi's going to get caught by three people. So this is just, this is a, a sad, sad situation. <laughs> he And he goes for the support, uh, bad move, and he uses his, his vaulting, so he's he's stuck. There's just nothing he can do at this point. Um, well played. Good job, team. Uh, our, our team is getting into good situations, and uh, their team is doing their best, but uh, we, are, we are definitely making the plays. Um, we are uh, ahead in gold now, uh, almost 13k to 10k, so we, we have quite a good lead for this point in the game, and we're also pressuring these towers. Um, we're getting close to, let's see, we're getting close to 10 minutes into the game, which means our video is going to have to cut cut short uh, in a little bit here, but uh, just, uh, just go on over to part 2 of this video, and you can see the rest of it. Um, Alright, have a little bit of lull in the fighting. Uh, the tower's going to get low, but we're not actually going to engage here. I don't believe I've used my ult yet, though, so I'm, I'm kind of waiting for a good situation to do that. And it looks like uh, these guys are pressuring bottom, um, so either top or bottom I could I could do some ganking. Um, but I'm going to get my red first. Uh, their team is definitely farming well. Rengar is doing a good job of farming, and Jinx is also a little bit ahead in, in her farm. Uh, she, she does manage to pick off Zed, which was a really nice play. Um, but because because her support is so low, this gives uh, this gives me a good opportunity. And they're pre they're pushed. They're, they don't they don't head back to their tower at this point. If she had caught Ezreal there, they might have gotten the kill. But Ezreal is <laughs> is really good. And um, I've already used my Q, but I've got my ult, and so I flash ult. And you yeah, uh, as you can see. 
Um, she gets shut down now. Zed, I did miss that fight. I'm going to back it up a little bit so we can see that too. Because, as I said, I want to get everybody's fights in here. I want to make sure everybody has their screen time. Their, their moment of fame, man. Their moment of glory. Okay, I, come on. I want to watch this fight up here. Uh, the auto the auto tracking was was following that fight down there, but I want to see this up here. Zed Zed does a ton of damage, but they're almost e equal, and then the the death mark comes out. Nicely played, Zed. Well done. Uh, you still almost got killed, but you did a really good job there, and you made it out. Um, Fizz in the meantime pushing middle. Fizz is having a rough game. He does have one kill, uh, so that's not that's not terrible. Uh, not only two deaths, um, but he's. He's struggling versus Cassid. Apparently, Cassid and Fizz uh, are are uh, a matchup that favors favors Cassid. And uh, that was that was poorly done. Old. He still goes in anyway, and he's just he's just gonna die here. Um, this is not gonna work out. That was just he does a ton of damage though. I'm impressed uh, with his ignite, but um, I I think he he should have left as soon as his ult didn't work. Oh, he still almost gets it. Wow. That was close. That was close. So this Fizz, in, in another reality, uh, would probably be doing well against Cassidy. Um, I'm asking my, my buddies here to help me out. Uh, we're going to get this dragon. We're going to get it pretty much for free, I believe. Okay, the ult goes off. Nice ult. Almost gets Cassidy. If that had hit Cassidy, that would have been curtains. But, uh... Oh, he's, is he going to do it? Is he going to follow? No, he's not. Okay, so we we get our dragon. Uh, Leona's wandering around up here, but she's not. She's definitely not going to stop us. Um, they wanted me to come with them, uh, but I'm going to go ahead and back. Let's look at the 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 setup. Okay, we have uh, the items that everybody has. Zed Zed has uh, Zed's working working with the Bilgewater Cutlass. He's building his um, Blade of the Rune King, I believe. And uh, Ezreal, at 4-0, has is starting his uh, Trinity Force. He's got two parts of it, the Sheen and the Phage. And he's got a couple of Doran's Blades for, for regen. Um, I don't think there's any fights going on at the moment. Uh, so I'm just going to keep keep going with these items. And uh, Thresh is being a little bit risky up here, because they can definitely lock him down for a long time. Um, Thresh, Thresh has the, the good... So he's a good support. He has... Um, the Nomad's Medallion, which he's, he's building so that he can have that, that speed boost a little bit later on, and, and he's got the Sight Stone so he can lay down as many more as possible. If, you're looking, learn, if you want to learn how to support, watch this Thresh, because he, he definitely knows what, what he's doing. Um, he's got the Boots of Speed to keep up with his, uh, with his AD carry and, and with the fights that we're having. And uh, let's, let's move on down to Amumu. I like, I like to have a lot of armor uh, as Amumu, and I like to build my... Um, Sunfire Cape because I really want that extra area of effect damage. So we got got I'm building a Sunfire Cape and I'm also building um, I've got my my Spirit Stone for for the jungling help me take out the, uh, uh, the sorry the jung the jungle camps you know the monsters the, those guys the, the the blue buff the red buff the the race the big wraith the big white whatever it's called the uh, you know the that stuff uh, so. These guys are putting themselves in a bad position. They don't have a tower over here, and there's four of us on this side of the map. Um, they do catch our AD carry, but he's going to able to be able to jump away. Um, Thresh lays down an awesome ult. They still managed to get a kill, which I was very impressed by. But um, with my Q and my E, uh, this 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 is going to be our fight to win. And Kassan shows up at the last minute, helps us clear clear this out. Uh, Jinx does. Does she get it? Yes, she does. That was a really nice fight by her. She she took a bad situation, which could have been zero kills, and turned it into two kills. So that was that was well, very well played by her. Um, Top is in trouble. Dummy is is in a really bad situation, but he is Zed. So can he turn turn it into a better situation? It looks like he does. Yes, yes. Uh, the the minions combined with the ignite there takes down his opponent, and that was that was amazing. Uh, he I thought he was totally screwed, and wasn't going to get anything out of that. So, uh, the game is about halfway in, and I'm going to have to stop the stream and start the next part of the video. So tune in for the, for part two in just a.